This is the uh, TCAP practice test for grade 7, math section, question number 8. This question is one of those annoying questions that is really not nearly as hard as it seems like. There's a lot of numbers, and some of them are completely, uh, in a sense, they're completely useless to you, but you do need to know a couple things. One of the things you need to know is what the word increased means. You should know by now that increased means it goes up. Decrease is the other one. Decreased means that it goes down. D for decrease, down, that whole thing, you know. So what I'm going to do is make a little, sort of a, my own little graph here. Uh, I start out at 8 a.m. The next time is noon, so that would be 12. That's the worst 12 of all times. I can't even leave it like that, it's so bad. I meant to erase it, there it is. Sorry to waste your time. Now the other one is 4 p.m. That was just driving me insane. Like more so, I guess. Now that's the only reason to have those labels. They have no purpose. So I'm just going to mark them out from my paper. That way I get them out of my brain. And they want to know what the temperature is at 4 p.m. So I'm going to make an arrow to remind myself that's the one I'm looking for and just leave the rest alone. Uh, now, it was at 8 o'clock, negative 3 degrees Fahrenheit. So I'm going to make a statement that says negative 3 degrees Fahrenheit. Between those hours, it increased 5 degrees. So plus 5. Negative 3 plus 5 degrees would make it 2 degrees Fahrenheit at 12 o'clock. Then it decreased, so minus 7 degrees, it decreased 7 degrees by the last time that we have to worry about. So I did negative 3 plus 5 gives me 2, and after I use them, I'm just going to mark them out. Then I do 2 minus 7, which knocks me all the way down to negative 5 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's right here. That question is not that difficult. There's just a lot of extra stuff in there that you don't really need. But if you make a little sketch or something, I'm sure that it'll be completely fine and you shouldn't worry about it. The answer, of course, is H.